I met this girl five days ago. Her body and her face looked amazing, yo. We started drinking. Captain and Sprite. I was hoping that sex was gonna happen that night. Then she kissed me. We started messing around. I had a smile on my face when she started going down. It felt good for a second. Then straight. Oh, that's kind of nice, right? That's just to be considered great. I know you're drinking 80 proof Captain Morgan, but that's no excuse for the tooth to the foreskin. I'm already circumcised. I don't need a touch up. Now I gotta clean these cuts up. It's been five days, five long days since you've been in my room. And I'm still pouring out Neil's pour in the top of my room. It seemed like a good idea. At first, but you turn the best thing into the worst. Five days later, my shit still hurts. Ouch. And now the weird thing about it was she looked real whore like. One of those I've sucked a lot of dick before types. She looked more straight than Brianna Banks felt like putting a pork frank in a piranha tank. I wish I had a condom made of metal mesh like the divers use on Shark Week to protect their flesh. Ow. But alas, I was vulnerable. And with a teacher she gave my phone a pull. I told her it's cool, stop sucking, that shit hurts. But even with her hands, she just didn't understand how a dick works. <laughs> Treat it like a tube of toothpaste about to run out. She'd start from the bottom and try to squeeze and come out. It was pitiful, G. She took the phrase choking and shit. She used to be a farmhand, blood drops on her. Breast cancer R band. That's when I knew I had to flee, so I got up and I told her I had to pee. Then I tiptoed out the door, quiet as a mouse. When I got outside, I said, Shit, we're in my house. Ah. And so I went back in and I told her a fib. I said, My mom's on the way, coming over to the crib. And besides, I couldn't fuck if I wish. Look at my penis, it looks like a halfway gutted fish. And she left, and I went to my room, I got my first aid kit and started tending my wounds, and that shit still hurts. And this a week later, I joked about it with my friends, and we nicknamed her Cheese Grater. It's been five days, five long days since you've been in my room. I'm still pouring out the pouring about my wounds. It seemed like a good idea at first, but you turned the best thing into the worst. Five days later, my shit still hurts. <laughs>